Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, my name is Stephanie and this is Ginger Snap Kitchen. Today's video is part of a collaboration of American Recipes. I have linked all the participating channels in the description box below. After I got my store-bought pie crust unrolled, placed in the pan and crimped, I set it aside and I added one and a half cups of flour, one and a half cups of brown sugar, one teaspoon of ground cinnamon, half a teaspoon of ground nutmeg, and a pinch of salt to my mixing bowl. I combine them thoroughly with a fork. Then I added a quarter cup of cold cubed butter and I blended that all together first with a fork then with a pastry blender until it was well combined and crumbly once that was done I set it aside and I made the filling To another mixing bowl, I added three quarters of a cup of molasses, and three quarters of a cup of boiling water. I added half a teaspoon of baking soda, and I mixed it with a whisk until it was well combined. was very fizzy. I poured the watery mixture into my prepared pie shell. Then, I evenly spread the crumb mixture on top. I'm not going to lie to you, at this point I was very worried. I absorbed a little bit of the excess filling with a paper towel. Then I became very interested in seeing what was going to happen. I placed it in my 450 degree oven for 15 minutes, then I reduced the oven temperature to 350 degrees and baked for 20 more minutes. This is the monstrosity that came out on the other side. I allowed it to cool completely. Once it was fully cooled, it was easy to slice. Surprisingly, it tasted very good. I was a little concerned I'd never get this pie plate clean again, but I did. It was a very rustic, old-fashioned pie. It had a nice brown sugary type flavor and was even better the next day with vanilla ice cream. I'll probably make this again, but next time I won't overfill the pie shell. I hope you'll stop by the other channels in this collaboration to see what delicious American recipes they made. I bet they turned out prettier than mine. I hope you enjoyed watching me make this weird pie, and I hope you'll come back and see me again soon. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time.